Hi, I'm Chris Bird with the Bird's Eye View. Coming back at you with uh, Zab Judah, Pauli Malinazzi. It's a fight, you know, a Brooklyn fight. You know, big for the area. You know, big for Showtime also. And, and you know, style-wise, I thought, okay, if Zab pulled the trigger and could get his punches off being lefty, stronger, you know, really more experienced, like Pauli said, he looked up to him. He going to put it in work. Wasn't the case. Paulie, you know, with people saying he don't have a lot of pop to his punches, he looked physically, he looked strong. I mean, he looked, you know, a little more muscular than normal. His hands are fast. And Paulie's smart, you know, he, he uses his jab well. He constantly jabbing, jabbing to the chest, jab to the stomach. And his hands are fast enough to throw combinations while Zab couldn't really pull the trigger like he wanted to. And I thought the southpaw style would offset Paulie a little bit. It didn't. Paulie was just first in everything. First with combinations. First getting off. Doing his thing. And I think the, the jerkiness of his movement was throwing Zab off a little bit too. I mean, he constantly in front of you moving. And when he's moving like that, you don't know where the punch is coming from. You don't know if he's going to throw a punch or he's going to pause. What's coming next? And it kind of threw Zab off a little bit. And I thought Zab probably thought, this is going to be an easy fight when you look at it on paper. Paulie will punch it hard. He's good. Limited skills. Really, Paulie put in work. I mean, he, he was there for 12 rounds. Constantly moving. Look a little bit more powerful than normal. And just winning every round. I mean, cleanly. Doing a great job. And put himself back in a position where... He may be fighting for a title or, or a big fight next. Great win for him over a, over a legend, really. A Hall of Famer. I mean, Zab's been there. Maybe at the end of the road for Zab. Maybe his last big one. You never know. You know, more power to him. Love Zab Judah. That's my guy. So, you know, great win for Paulie. He moves on, especially off the fight with uh, Broner, like he said. You know, after that fight, he thought he, he really won. So, you know, he, he was, you know, tired of boxing. He back. And he's he's a hard guy to beat. I mean, that, I mean uh, Paulie is really good, skillful, smart, uh, can, you know, just give you all kind of problems. So that welterweight division is loaded. I mean, just a lot of talent in it. A lot of great matches can be made, and Paulie in the mix of that. Great form, and he moves on. Now you got the bird's eye view. Follow me at Slipmaster92 on Twitter. Subscribe to my channel always. Thank you very much.